Okay, we've got a little bit of an adventure on our hands here. So I've got these five characters out. We've got Mr. Wild right in front there. Not her. We've got Annie, Luke following her, uh, Lena and Roni out. And this lovely lady won't stop calling out. So I thought, well, maybe, maybe we'll put them out. Or put her out, sorry, <laughs> put her out with them. And um, see how she does. And then she's not calling out anymore. So she gets, or she has the opportunity to meet two more horses. We've got Roni and Annie. So we'll see what happens here. <sighs> Turn down again. I think... <laughs> see, I, I let her out and then she just stays at the gate. Hey big guy. How's it going? Luke, are you watching over at little Annie here? Give Annie a good brushings today. So she's a little bit more sorted out. Although you do look like you've been running around a bit. Hi Annie. Do you want to go say hi to the new horse? How do you feel? She says, could you just scratch me like you always do? A little bit. And he has the coolest colors. <laughs> she loves a good scratchings. Oh, here comes trouble. Hello, Lena. Oh, you bit her. Aw. <laughs> Sorry, Annie, she didn't get you hard or nothing. Doesn't seem like she much got her at all. So, yeah, uh, I had a lot of questions on what would Roni, oh, she's moving because Lena's telling her to. I'm gonna come over this way a bit. What would Roni do if he had a uh, little Annie in here and Lena? For the most part, he sticks with Lena. What's happening up there? It's a little chitty chat. What do you want? Lena's such a big horse, I really have to raise the camera up. So those two are getting along a little bit. At least she's not yelling out anymore. Um, something I do worry a little. Oh. <laughs> Lena, why do you got to push everybody around? What's, what's happening here? What's wrong with Annie? Does she smell funny? You and your big ears. Oh, he's getting in trouble again. Hmm. You know, what would you do if I just kept walking? Just keep walking upwards. I put zinc oxide on this little thing so that the flies wouldn't get to it. And then you've still got flies. Sometimes horses get little cuts or little something or others and then the flies kind of pester it and then they scratch it again and it gets a little worse. You put a little zinc oxide on that sucker. Usually pretty effective. Yeah, so you see Roni just kind of sticks with Lena, but if Mr. Wild there 
uh, tries to go after Annie, then he steps in between. But now he's got her to play with. Just a good old horsey day. All kinds of horse stuff going on. Training and playtime and chores and... And it's a beautiful day. Got some gorgeous blue skies, a little cloud. Here's Annie again. Hello, little Annie. How you doing? No, I'll just stick to this side. There you go. She's so little. It's, just, it's cute. Well, if anything happens, I'll bring you guys back. But for the most part, I expect quite a bit of quiet. She really knows how to sort out her space. And now she's in with the herds, so she doesn't have to get all upset in her paddock. And he's gonna step on my feet. Maybe. Hello, Annie. Watch my feet, okay? Little tiny Annie butt. <laughs> Up against the fence, too. Not the safest place to be, but I've never seen Annie give me any trouble. So, I think I can trust her. Famous last words? I don't know. When he's trying to guide Lena around a little bit, he's like, don't go that way. And Luke. And he left. Why? Because Lena's coming over. Oh, Takaya's having a, a little roll. Maybe Annie's gonna go say hi to her. Oh, no, she moved. So I've got, I've got horses here. Hang on, let me come around. What's gonna happen? Oh no, Ronnie's gone over. Okay, so let me, oh, I thought I would referee a little bit. Hang on, let's see if she can make it back around. She's gotta come around this way. Hi, Annie. I know, go get her. Go get her. Luke's going over, he's a friend. We know that. Hmm. Hmm. Well, you almost made it, Andy. You could have. If uh, the boys didn't get in the way. What if we sent her back up to the top? Is it worth it? Or should we just... Hey, pal. Oh, here comes Lena. Oh, Lena. A co groom between these two, it's unusual. Roni the third wheel is hanging out off to the side. Hmm. It's unusual. Here comes Annie behind me. This is unusual. I'm glad I caught the camera out for this. It's not too often I see these two together. Usually Lena's telling them to go away and stuff. But I guess he's not bad at uh, a little co-grooming. My goodness. Luke's trying to make a friend. So I think the herd is going to do pretty well. I think in comparison to her calling out and crying out, it's better for her to be in here and try to work things through. Nobody seems to be too interested in pushing her around or telling her to do anything. 
other than this guy, I suppose, but he's busy now anyways. Luke's a friend. He says, I'll stay by you. It's unusual she's in the back corner. Usually she's up at the top. And Annie could care less. Oh, there, that's... Oh, she, she bit both of them. Ugh. <laughs> Lena did not get the grooming. She, oh, hey man, <laughs> what happened? What did you do? What What are you doing? What'd you do? Did you make Lena angry? Here she comes. I'm gonna back up. I guess they'll try again. Very normal. It is interesting. The dock of a horse, the the top of their tail is usually quite itchy. Here comes Ronnie. I think Lena's just got too much pressure when Roni comes over. <laughs> Roni, you are a third wheel, my friend. This guy's finished last. It's like, what? Ah, oh, here we go. The meeting we've been waiting on a little bit. Ah, oh, where do I go? Okay, I'm in the middle of a lot. I'm out. I am out. Gross. <laughs> oh man. Horses, eh? Okay, so she needs to make it out. What I'm going to do is, well, I don't know, maybe I should I assist or just leave it alone? She, she did it, she managed to help herself out a bit there. I'm gonna come over this way. <sighs> it's gotta get it sorted, I wanna step in. Annie wants to say hi. She's a little worried. She's got to race through. She can't. Roni gets in the way. And he's such a sweetie too. Why does she need to get out of the way of that? What's Roni doing and why is he doing it? Uh-oh. Oh, I almost had to step in. Oh, and he got smacked, hit. She's just too worried. Let's go check on Annie. Where'd she get hit? Back up, back up, back up. She's going to the top. She says, let's give us another try. Luke says, don't do it. I think. Trying to make it around Luke. He won't let her. I'm going to um, move Luke. Just let Annie do what she wants. Oh, she's going back to the back. Maybe. Annie, how'd you do? Where'd you take the hit? Sounded like the chest. Right there. Oh, you don't seem worse for wear. Hey. This has got to work it out. Just 
moving and he wants to go see again I'm going to send Luke so he stops being with Annie for now so that way send him away go and give these two another opportunity without all of the pressure of so many horses And he's such a sweetie. It's hard to imagine anybody being worried about her. Oh. Nope, doesn't look good. Oh, you tried. Yeah. You tried a little. What's the matter? How come you don't want to be friends with anybody? Hello. You okay? We're all right. You wanted to come in here. You were calling out. I let you in. Guess it's on her terms, isn't it? That's the way we should probably look at it. She's leaving because these three are coming over. And he still wants to try. Luke says it's a bad idea. Trust me. Just let it be. Look at how smart Luke is. He is such a smarty pants. Let the big guy take care of this, I guess. I think he's made the most progress. Like this, like being able to touch. Oh geez, these two started to wander over. So yeah, I think he's made good progress and Luca's made good progress. And uh, she's... Well, way to go, tough guy. Look at you move Luke around. So, all being part of the herd. Hello, Lena. Oh, you gotta push him off. Guess I better be careful here. I'll just back up. Ever <laughs> so carefully. I've not really seen him kick out though, that's for sure. Oh God, this is put a shoulder into me and I'm on the fence. You monkey. Okay, well. As always, I'm gonna let them just mill around together and be a herd. She's, even though she's not really, you know, making a large effort to be close to the herd, she's in here and she's happier for it, guaranteed. The amount that she was calling out with everybody out and about, except for her, and Gracie actually, for that matter, who's over there, um, it was, you know, it's distressing when they have to call out a lot. They feel like they have to call out a lot. So by putting them in, at least giving it a try, then uh, she has an opportunity to start being part of the herd. I know what you want. I don't want to give it. Can't remember if he backs up if I pull. Yeah, he does. Try again. Uh, I don't know if he will. Oh, he did. Good. Good boy. You got a good memory, pal. I always teach my horses to back up if I pull on their tail a little. <sighs> it's 
She's working at it. Takes time. You guys can see the evolution of Mr. Wild here, getting his manners sorted out a little bit. Horse behaviors, good to learn them. Good to let them happen. You can't have a herd without horses being hurt, uh, a herd, herd mentality, like the way they, they're just gonna act in and amongst themselves. What are you doing? That's a bad idea. Don't do it. <laughs> God. Okay, I'm gonna leave it at that. This has been pretty long. Good 20 minutes or so of watching these guys go about. And, uh, oh, it's a lot of pressure. Um, any questions, let me know. Of course, any thoughts, feel free to write them down, as always. Hopefully watching these guys has been a little bit interesting and informative, seeing how things come along. The closer the herd, the better the herd, the more horses are together, can be together, the better. They learn their hierarchy, they learn their position. <laughs> and that's a good thing. Okay, that's it for now. <laughs> I will see you guys oh, in the next one. Oh, Roni. He's a drive-by horse too. He doesn't actually ever do anything. I wonder when she'll figure that out. He never attacks. He never does anything. Just kind of pretends to. Just all Lena in front of me. Okay. For sure this is it. And uh, until next time.